Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to make sure that when you reseed your lawn or plant new grass, you help it to grow better. This is for spot seeding. This is a cool formula or a little tonic that you can mix up that you can spray on this brand new seed or grass right in this area and it will really help it get off to a great start. So a few simple ingredients. It's a cup of beer, a cup of baby shampoo, and then four tablespoons of the instant tea. So we've got our hose and sprayer right here. We're gonna simply take the uh, king of beers and pop it open. We'll throw a cup in there. Now, does it matter, you say, if I use a liquid measuring cup or a dry measuring cup? The answer is it really doesn't for this purpose. We're not making anything uh, like a cake or anything really finicky, so it really isn't a super big deal. The main thing is you get a cup of each item in there. We're running a little low on the baby shampoo, but don't worry, I've got another one. Look at that, they don't even seal it so people don't drink it. Why would they drink it anyway, right? All right, cup of each. Okay, and then four tablespoons of instant tea. Looks like the instant tea is a little hard, not to worry. Kind of mix it up. We want it to be as loose as possible because if it's really big and clumpy, then it's going to have a harder time dissolving. One, two, three. Hmm. Three and a half, maybe, huh? All right, and four. Okay, so we've got all that in there. Now, what we're gonna do is screw this cap on. Then we're gonna shake this up a little bit. Obviously we have beer in there, so we have to be careful about shaking it up because it'll foam and fizz and we don't want any unnecessary explosions to happen. So that's it. We're gonna give it a little toss. Now you have two options right here. You can fill this up with water. You see we're only at about the 12 to 14 ounces. You could fill that up with water and then spray it on your brand new grass or brand new lawn. Or you can just spray it as is and just leave the setting at like one ounce. If you fill it up with water, you maybe want to do a two ounce mixture because then you're getting more per square foot on your lawn. Or again, it really is up to you on the proportion you want to use. Me personally, I'm gonna leave it just like this and I'm gonna leave that on one ounce and that's what I'm gonna spray on the lawn to give it a little bit more concentrated dose. So here we go. We'll go show you the spraying application on the lawn. All right guys, here we are out on the grass. So this is some grass that I have recently repaired and I sprayed this with the tonic we just mixed up. Now I didn't spray it right now, I sprayed this about a week and a half ago, 10 to 12 days ago, with the tonic we just mixed up. The beer, the baby shampoo, and the instant tea, all right? This section, I haven't sprayed. So you can see, there's just some grass coming up. It's not as thick, it's not as nice. I've also got some weeds in there but this spot is the spot that I sprayed. So you can tell there is a difference. What all we do is spray it right here, just like this, right over all the new seed, all the fresh stuff, and you just coat it down. You really wanna soak it. Soak it well, a lot of it. You're gonna turn this into mud. It's gonna be a mud patch that you wanna do and that's gonna really help that new seed, that fresh lawn. I'm gonna give this another spray, just because it's not gonna hurt. It looks beautiful already. So you can see here, we've sprayed 
to the point of runoff. That's our motto in all these grass videos. We spray to the point of runoff. As the seed sprouts and comes up, you're going to want to hit it again with this tonic. So you can see I still have some left. So wait about a week. As it comes up, you got little blades of grass coming. Spray it again. And then in a, about 14 days, you know, 10 to 2 weeks, 10 days to 2 weeks, it'll look like this. And it'll be just beautiful, nice, thick lawn that you can treat with other tonics as well.